Here's what would happen if you drank only water for 20 days. The first two days would be the worst. In days three to seven, a process of ketosis would occur. You'd also feel less hungry and more energetic. However, you would still get bad headaches and have bad night's sleep. In days eight to 14, you would experience clarity of mind and you'd feel happy and energetic. Very few people reach days 15 to 20 of water fasting, so you'd feel very proud. However, you'd be ready to eat some solid so, food again. I love that this guy is maybe 16 and giving us all advice, but that's okay. I guess the first thing to say is at least he's not talking about it being a breatharian. A breatharian is somebody who just breathes air, gets energy from the air, it doesn't need any food or water. When it comes to fasting though, it's a much more nuanced discussion because some people I just can't fast for various reasons, because they're too sick, they have too many chronic complex medical issues, it's gonna cause significant weight loss and can cause significant amounts of stress in the system. He does say some good points here that once you start fasting after about three days or so, you do go into ketosis, you will get more clarity and anybody tells you that they get hangry, it's like they're just glucose addicted. Not everybody should listen to this advice. Not everybody, in fact, most people don't ever have to do 20 days. Most of the research has shown about five days is the most that you need to get all the major benefits of fasting.